Okay, there it is. Finally, got it spinning. Wow, even this little tiny coil I made. There's my two batteries. Here's the intro vertebrates version. And here I have my little pot. For some reason, I wasn't able to get the Elfman version working. This one definitely is working. And I have it all the way up to the top. And here's the deceleration. Turn it again. Yes, accelerator. Here's my neon. 213055 NPN version. This is a 480 ohm resistor. It's connecting to my pot on the left side. And over here you'll notice that this is writing two of the connectors of the pentiano. Look that baby's been. What I'm going to do is disconnect one of these batteries. And this will start to slow down. What I have to do is actually put some gaffer tape, or you might want to call it the, uh, I taped up my magnets on here, because I did have one of them go flinging off, because all they're doing is being held on by this, I have the, uh, the magnet here being held on with this plastic stuff. That melted in plastic crap. Doesn't melt very well. So I put the tape on with gaffer tape or whatever tape you want to call it. And here is my core. Check this out. I have a ferrite core. That's a ferrite. It's not very long, as you can tell. Here's my finger. It's like half of my finger. By filler. I just have it resting on this little uh, tape thing I put here. At an equal distance so it won't hit. I go around. Pick up the battery. There it goes. It's a beauty. It's really working. Yeah, baby. I got it working. Can't stand the time it took to get this thing done. I have to resort to changing the designs, though. So there it is. All I have to do is just put this in a nice little box for itself and carry this thing around. Thanks for watching.